So I am uh, adding a jib to thorn and uh, you can make thorn with three sheets of uh, ply and you notice the key feature is the center bench. Which actually really makes it nice and easy to balance. And as far as uh, leaning to the sail, you actually ride on this like a motorcycle. You just lean over or put your hand over on the rail. It's, it's nice and easy that way. Look at this go now. Hat is on my head, so that's good. Okay. Enough. Let's see if I can set this up so it works. On this thing, I lean a little like a motorcycle. Just lean over. But the bench seat's kind of fun. It's comfortable. And that's a uh, sail shape. Anyways, this is the new jib for Thorn. So it's not rigged perfectly yet. Uh, I made a little bow spit, sprit. Um, uh, we gotta go to this side to see that. Basically hinged it on there, toggle it down to the uh, bow cleat. And I have a little pin here. I put a little penny on, um, on here to um, act as a screwdriver to uh, to screw that on so it's uh, it's fairly fairly solid solid enough for what it is and I just finished making a couple little wooden cleats because uh, I'm just going to have one sheet I can easily slide up and spread uh, move the move the jib sheet over to uh, to the other side and and I needed a place to cleat it down low I may still cut the jib and um, make it uh, a little smaller, we'll see. It may only need to be at this point, but uh, I'll try it uh, at some point with, uh, with it as it is. But this is, what, um, this is what I've come up with for now. And I tried uh, a jib, uh, just a tablecloth, out, out at the lake we were staying. Uh, while the shape is terrible, it's a tablecloth after all, uh, it actually worked really good. I was really pleased with it. So we're going along pretty nice. And I doubt very much this, I figured out a way, a way to cleat my, uh, cleat my jib on the, uh, on the dagger board. <laughs> so lots of fun. Let us move. We're going sweet. The jib, as crappy as that tablecloth is, the jib is working. So it tells me the, the concept of a jib. When the wind starts to blow hard, it seems almost like the nose lifts a little bit. And that's kind of cool. For an experiment, I think, uh, you know, I'm going to rig this much nicer. But I'm going to take measurements off of how far from the boom, uh, from the mast it is. And I'm going to arrange a hinged... I'm going to hinge something on the mast itself. That'll that'll really uh, bring it in. Okay, I got to sail again. The wind's gusty. So, back to sailing. When I got to play with her, and, and it's a really fun boat. So, uh, I, I enjoyed, and I actually hooked up a trolling, uh, a trolling method where I could uh, sail and fish at the same time. That was a hoot. So, and I caught something, but I went all YouTube-ish and ended up... Uh, Ended up losing the fish, but it was a good fish and gave up a good fight. I caught a little clip of that. I got a big fish on. Oh, well, I'm going to lose it if I keep this up. I oh, know, keep tension on it. <laughs> Put the camera between my legs. So trolling with the sailboat works. He's pulling. Oh, I don't even know how to film. <laughs> I can't film. Oh, he's still there. Oh, I thought he shook it. I don't know what it is. Oh, he's, this looks good. I've painted these sails. They, they're scraps from old sails that uh, I re-sewed using dental floss or nylon, whatever, whatever thread you happen to have that's good and strong. Uh, metal rust paint is what I use. Uh, Tremclad happens to be what I had. And I mix, mix a little bit of uh, darker color into it and uh, thinned it down and you roll it on and then you rub it off you, with uh, lots of rags, so. So Thorn's now fairly old. She's been around a little while. Great little sailor. Also, she motors 
with an electric motor and you put the battery in the in the bunk or a two horse two point five and uh, she rose quite nice too and it has a single dagger board that goes in the slot there the foams there so that when you're towing it's an old mop head uh, when you're towing basically water doesn't splash up or you're rowing you just throw that in there and plus then you have a sponge to sponge out a cool addition to the boat how about that uh, feel free to visit roydesignthat.com thanks for watching Let's see, what's his sail say? Oh, he shook it off, did he? He shook it off. Did I hope you saw it jump. I caught something, darn it. Ah, at least hopefully I caught it on tape to show D. <laughs> I, okay, next time I'm not gonna play with the camera because I caught it, could have probably kept tension on. I didn't keep tension on. Bad mistake, oh well. I wanted to catch it on film too though, right? Okay, sail.